Hi, boys and girls. Welcome to morning meeting. Well, it's another snowy day. And I wonder if you know what this is. Yes, it's a snowman. Did you build a snowman today or yesterday? I didn't. Maybe I will later. Okay, so let's read it. Ready? I'll count to three and you read. One, two, three. Good job. Hello, snowman caterpillars. Now down here, do you know what that is? Right, it's a window. I drew a window, a wintry window. Can you see what's outside the window? There's a snowman and a mailbox. And do you see those blue sparkles? It's snowing outside the window. So is it a summer window picture? It's a winter window picture. So let's read the message together. Hello, snowman caterpillars. Today we will read about our winter window. So, let's get out our scholastic reader with the big snowman on it. Got it? If you don't have it, stop the video, go get it and come back. I will be here. Okay. So, what is the snowman wearing on his head? Right, a hat. And what's he wearing around his neck? A scarf. And is the snowman inside the window or outside? Well, if he was inside the window, would that be a good idea? What would happen to him? He would melt. So he's outside the window. And it says, my winter window. And guess what? I see three letter W's. Let's count them. One, two, three. Do you guys know what this letter is? It's kind of like a W, isn't it? It's an M. M has three legs that go down, and W has three legs that go up. So it says, my winter window. Out my window, I see a silly snowman. I wonder what you see out your window today. All right, let's go to the middle. Oh, wait a minute. Find the number one in the red circle. How many hats are next to it? Right, one, because we're on page one. Okay, now let's go to the middle. So let's look at each color. Here's the purple window. Put your finger on the purple window. Put your finger on the green window. Put your finger on the pink window the blue window, and the orange window. Okay. So let's start with the pink window. What are they doing outside that window? Take a really good look. Now remember, you have your Scholastic Reader in front of you. You don't have to look at mine. You can look at yours. Right, they're riding on something and they're going down a hill. What are they gonna do? They're sledding. It says, out my window, I'm sorry, out my winter window, I see a sliding sled. And what number's that? That's one. Let's go to the green window with a number two. 
Tell me what's outside that window. It's a tree. And that kind of a tree has, has needles, not leaves, so it's an evergreen tree. Outside, out my winter window, I see an evergreen tree. It's pretty, isn't it? It looks like it's very sunny there. Okay, let's look at the purple box. What number is this? A three. Out my winter window, I see icicles on a bicycle. Icicle, bicycle. They rhyme. Wow, what a surprise. Look at that. Do you think it's cold out? Yeah, it's cold out because it has to be very cold for there to be icicles on a bicycle. You know what I'm noticing? That the top sentence in each box that we've read has been the same. It always says, out my winter window. So let's look at the blue box. And you guys read it because it's been the same all along. Ready? I'll count to three. You read. One, two, three. Out my winter window, I see two. What do you see? Two dogs. And they're dressed up. I see two dressed up dogs. What's he wearing? A hat. What's he wearing? Can you see it? He's also wearing a hat. They look funny, don't they? Let's look at the orange box. Oh, it says, look out your winter window. Is it cold or warm where you live? So is it? Is it cold or warm? It's cold. It's a cold day today. Right now, outside my window, it's snowing right now. All right, let's see. Let's see what's going on in this box. So it looks like outside it's very cold. There's snow on the evergreen trees. And I guess that's her dad. And what do you think he's telling her? He's saying, it's cold out, put on your coat. Does she want to put on her coat? What do you think? Looks like she's frowning. Hmm, let's see what she says. Oh, it says, it is cold out. Emily Elizabeth does not want to put on her coat. She says, it takes too long. What should she do? Do you think it really takes that long to put on a coat? I don't. Maybe she could ask for help. She could ask her dad to help her. Maybe she's not good at zipping yet. She could ask her dad to zip for her. Looks like she already has her boots on. Wouldn't take too long to finish getting dressed. She could stay in. I don't know. Maybe you have some ideas. So let's see. Can you find the number two in the red circle? There it is. And let's count the hats. Ready? Good job. There's two. And do you see the number three? Count the hats. Good, there are three. Okay, let's go to the back. Oh, now see the color of the arrows? What color is this one? Green, and this arrow is yellow. This one is red, and this one is blue. Now I wonder if you can figure out the directions. What do you think you need to do on this page? The hat is green. So what do you do? 
Right, you color the hat green. Let's read this one. The scarf is yellow. So you'll color his scarf yellow. Let's read the next one. The mittens are red. Let's do the last one. The boots are blue. So when you finish doing this after morning meeting, send me a picture of it. Let's see. Oh, it says learn more. Circle what you want to do online. So if you ask someone you love to help you go to this website, there's some games to play. So the last thing I need you to do is to count these hats. Ready? One, two, three, four. And this is a number four. All right, boys and girls, have fun with your Scholastic Reader, and I'll see you next time. Bye.